Hey everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Dark Souls 3. Still up here on Archdragon Peak, one of the uh, most awesome looking areas in the game so far. Maybe the most awesome looking. I just love this entire design, can't stress that enough. And those <laughs> those uh, peaks, or is it just one actually, in the distance, with what looks like it might be a, an actual arch dragon, a dead arch dragon, turned to stone. So yeah, what we have to do today, or we don't have to, but the plan for today is to explore this area where we previously, well, fought, rather run away, ran away rather than fought, really, uh, the, uh, the wyvern, wyvern. Um, collecting items like these that I didn't get before. Embers, for example. No trap here. Hmm. Stalk dunk pies. Awesome. Try right. Oh. Oh ho ho ho. Indeed. Oh, well, this is. Hmm. I might have overlooked this. So you know what? Why don't I be nice here and actually? appraise these decent people pointing out items to me. Uh, I guess maybe I... yeah, I could have seen this from above actually. Ring of Steel Protection, oh nice. Armor increase. Or absorption I guess as it's called in this um, in this iteration. Let's take a look at it once we're back on safe terrain. Uh, steel protection, steel. Pr there it is. Increases physical damage absorption. Yeah. By how much? Eh, I guess a pretty decent amount, actually. Uh, Ring of the Night King of Ancient Leaven, uh, Leaven of Ancient Legend, increases physical damage absorption. The ki the Night King was said to be lined with steel on the inside, such that even the talons of mighty dragons did him did him little harm. Huh. Lined with steel on the inside. I don't know if that's so good. Right. So, I guess just to make sure we didn't actually or didn't actually overlook anything else on the way here. Okay, so you can enter this little. Whoa. <laughs> this little thing here. This little ledge. Yeah, well thing here, but we could have definitely seen the uh, the ring from from this platform. What does this say? Plunging attack. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That worked very well. All right. I don't think there's anything else here. Have we been to these platforms? Mm. We might. Well, that up there is... yeah. That's where I did the plunging attack from. Alright. Let's continue on then. I guess... Those couple of items were all there was on the right. But I kind of rushed through these buildings here. On the left side. A little bit. Constantly, oh right, there was this item. Large soul. Fair enough. There was this, uh, yeah, there, uh, you know, there was that wyvern breathing fire and being noisy outside and those uh, man snakes, man snake warriors being annoying all the time and being also very deadly, by the way. Lightning urn. Te urn, as it were. All right. I all oh right. I did not take care of these guys yet. Oh, that was bad. Oh, well, not getting the lock on immediately was also bad. But fortunately, uh, even without the damage boost, I can still one-shot them with a stab with my profane greatsword plus five max level. Awesome. 
a very good weapon. Still like it a lot. Okay. Well, this guy shouldn't be too much of a problem now. Without the wyvern constantly threatening. Oh, there's a ladder. A ladder down. Never had time to uh, look around here carefully. Basically just ran up those stairs as fast as I could. Oh, okay. There's some kind of item here. Oh, okay. I see. Two Twinkling Titanites, fair enough. Although I do think that I have plenty of those by now. But yeah, just in general, this, this area is really upgrade material central. Oh, and we have like one guy dropping down and one coming down the stairs, maybe? Nice. Wild time, if I do say so myself. Oh, ho, 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 there you are. Nice. <laughs> I was hoping that would work out that way. This is, I think this is the corner where, where I rolled off once. In uh, somewhat of a panic. Also, another item just hidden in front of that extremely bright background. Dung pies. Um, uh, yeah. Okay. Hello, okay. You saw me, or heard me, or whatever. Let's heal. Really no reason to be stingy with... with Estus at this point. Left. Yeah, there's one more. They're everywhere. Every freaking where. Okay, and then there's that guy with that chain great axe. That's a nasty weapon. Try plunging attack. Oh, I guess I... Yeah, I guess that's the perfect spot. And I ran right into that. I smashed my face against that fireball. Okay. Any... Normal... Man serpents here? No? Oh, is this just a... Another way up this tower where there's another giant man serpent? Patrolling? Looks to be that way. What weapon does he have? Just a normal great axe? In theory, that should be no problem at all. However, theory. Oh, wait. Did I get turned around? Oh, yeah, okay, that's the other tower. Gotcha. Oh, hello, I didn't even see you here. Good thing I looked around. That would have been a nasty surprise, indeed. I don't think you can backstab these these large dudes. Unfortunately. But maybe I can... Eh, probably not. Nice, okay. That worked. Surprisingly enough. Okay. Very good. Very good. Large Titanite. And a Lightning Gem. Titanite Chunks. Wow. Lots of Titanite Chunks here. Lightning Bolts. I suppose those are probably kind of useful against... against these Man Serpents. Oh, hello. Fireballs will hit me. From here. Oh, yeah. Awesome. Right through the wall. That makes sense. Do not have my bow with me, currently. I do want to shoot that guy, though. Um, Dragon Rider, Dragon Slayer... Yeah, sure. Why not? Uh, what kind of arrows do I have? I have lightning arrows still equipped. So let's see how the dude likes those. Oh, nope, nope, wrong arrow. Wrong arrow entirely. I will probably get hit in the process. Oh, this could be bad. Yeah, the arrow is probably going to get stuck here. Okay, didn't want to 
waste one of my precious, precious arrows. Is he gonna hit me here? Sure enough, sure enough. Okay. I'm just going to eat it. Um, wait. Why don't I shoot? Oh, no, I didn't. That didn't de deal nearly as much damage as I hoped it would. That was a total waste. Okay. Um, that was bad. Hmm, I guess. Wait, uh, the bow of Ferris does have considerably longer range, so maybe at this uh, lo long range fight here. What's the guy doing? I don't think he's seen me. I don't know why he's freaking out like that. Uh, or why his AI is, <laughs> I don't know, breaking. So, uh, even though the Bow of Ferris deals surprisingly little damage compared to just any old regular bow, uh, it might deal more damage at this distance, just because the uh, damage dealt will drop, will not drop as quickly. Ouch, yeah, waited too long there. Oh, didn't aim high enough. Okay, sorry for taking this relatively slowly, but I really want to be able to focus on the big dude. That should do it? Okay. It didn't quite do it, because that last arrow dealt even less damage than before. And that missed completely? How? Oh. I hit the wall. Oh, come on. Hit between his legs. Thank you. All right. That used up so much Estus. Kind of bad. Yeah, and don't know what's wrong with him. Oh, hello. Did he see me? I guess not. Not really. I mean, yeah, a plunging attack would be nice, however, I have learned that he is perfectly able to attack me from below with his chain axe, which is a pretty sick weapon, if I do say so. Okay. Whoa, hello. That's not quite what was intended. Yeah, yeah, step off. That's fine, too. Up or fall. Okay. Oh, hello there, item. Is that what he dropped, or is there a corpse? I think there's a corpse, actually. We'll see, though. If I can go down there. Wait a second. Oh, no, never mind. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, by the entrance. So that must be what he dropped. wonder, is it worth... It might be his weapon, so I think it's... Or was it? Ah, camera, please. Please cooperate. Well, I know it's... It, yeah, it's right there. Okay. So I guess it's worth going back for that. This guy dropped something as well. Tight night chunk. Okay. Oh, I didn't even... Yeah, that's what, what was happening. It had me confused. Uh, I wasn't two-handing. Whoops. Same old mistake. Okay, we'll... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we have established that a hit with this, if I actually end up hitting... well, that works as well, but, you know, that uh, a charged attack like that will knock their shield away. You know what? Why don't I... Why don't I? Yeah, the door is, uh, or the gate is right below me here, so I should, in theory, be able to get down relatively quickly. And with that, we seem to have explored everything there was that I missed before. Let's see here. If I do drop from here... There should be more platforms this way, right? Yeah. 
Okay, so we drop down to this platform, this very crucial platform. Then we walk over here. And on here. Too bad there are no items up here. But, oh well. And then we're right by the gate. And I'm also almost dead. But that's okay. Almost dead is fine. It's completely dead that's uh, bad and should be avoided. Okay. Right. This guy needs to come out here so I can actually target him. And stab him. So far so good. The item that dropped... Wait. Wait. Isn't it here? Um, was it on the other side? Am I am I crazy? Wasn't it here? It totally was, wasn't it? What the heck? This is the correct wall. Should be the correct platform. Why did it disappear? Was it on his corpse? Actually? That sucks. Uh, well, I will... Um, let me see here. Uh, I will re-log and... Or, well, you know, leave the game and re-enter. And uh, make a quick cut. Well, I'm all the way back up here. And his corpse or loot are nowhere to be found. So, whatever that was, it's lost now. Lost to the abyss. That sucks. Let's just hope it wasn't actually his weapon. If that is even a thing that can drop and that you can get and use and, you know, all that. Now, the other... The other thing we can do here is continue down the path that is... Uh, I think it was upstairs? There's also these lizards here. There's also those constantly respawning knights. Wasn't there a lizard here? Oh, they're over here, right? Yeah. Oh, hello. Ouch. Yeah. Oh, wow. Holy crap. Getting hit by that entire attack is bad. Gotcha. Duly noted. What? They do drop Titanite scales. Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay. That changes everything. So these respawn and they do drop Titanite scales, even though probably at a ridiculously low rate, if I had to guess. And now back up to five. Not that I need any, you know, immediately right now for this weapon. This weapon has reached its maximum level, so we're good on that. However... Oh, hello. Wait, where's this platform? Did I ever go there? Oh yeah, I totally did. Yeah, yeah, of course. Gotcha. Sure enough. Oh, also this person. Um, I guess I do wanna... Ah, oh, come on. Use some of this. Oh, don't do it. What do you drop? Do you drop anything? Oh. Probably, but not right now. Okay, where's the knight? The knight is... Down there, okay. Not sure if he's actually seen me, but... I don't need to... Oh, wasn't this where the, where the ambush was? No, it, it totally was. Can't step through that. That's fine, though. I don't need to worry about the warrior or these uh, man serpents at all. Dear, what do you mean? So there, yeah, there most definitely is a way to get to the other side of that gate, which is my ultimate goal, I suppose. Or not necessarily the ultimate goal, but 
the short term goal. Let's see how that turns out, how that works out. We have been all the way over there, and I'm not sure if we actually see the wyvern there. If it is there, then it's not moving currently. Thanks for biting me through that corner. That's awfully nice of you! Jesus. Okay. Also, input buffer caused me to attack again, or do a follow-up attack. That I did not intend on performing. Oh, hello. Thanks. For opening your your defenses. Time for ranged battle. Ranged battle against whom exactly? From here? Hmm. Don't really see anybody. I mean there's that guy. Oh hello, hello. Hello. Goodbye. Jesus. How rude. Oh, there are actually two. Oh, well, trading hits here. It's not great. Though for the time being, it does get the job done. Oh, hello. Maybe, maybe that guy. Wow, he's really skinny underneath that robe. Oh, this is bad. Don't like this at all. I don't like being stuck on this corner. Well, that would have been a nice attack to be close, closer to him when he while he was doing it, because that leaves him very, very vulnerable. Okay. Good. Jesus. Yeah, I had completely forgotten about that, and also his colleague didn't help. I mean, you helped him. It's nice and all that, but can't really appreciate it. Appreciate that to the same degree. Okay, so we have that building over there, right? And as soon as I step out there, a wyvern. Yeah, that wyvern actually. Hello. Oh, huh, interesting that you can see it from here. Didn't notice before. I wonder what it's going to do if I try to shoot it. It's only one way to find out, really. Well, two ways. The other being looking it up on YouTube, which I'm not... <laughs> I don't want to do, <laughs> so... Okay. That is way too far away to deal any... noticeable damage, if I even hit. I don't know. It might be too far away to even reach at all. Or well, my arrows might be dropping too far... too... too early to even reach it. Hmm, that's... Unfortunate because I don't think I will be getting a better angle here. Well, I could. Wasn't there a way to. Yeah, there's a ladder to climb up to this platform, but. Unless the um, Dragon Rider bow or not Dragon Rider. Let's see here. No. They only have a range of 50. So Ferris is indeed by far my best range weapon in terms of range. That's unfortunate. If I come out there and step just around, uh, around the corner enough to be able to target him, he will probably also... oh, that statue just looked weird for a second. He'll also probably uh, be dropping down and attacking me directly, so... that's kinda bad. I'm gonna give it, like... Maybe a couple more shots. Yeah, my arrow is dropping way too fast. Problem is, I don't really see it even after a certain point. It just disappears completely. There, I saw it. What if I. Wait, can't I. do. Super shot? Oh no, that's that one. That's not what I wanted. That doesn't help at all, actually. I don't see how this uh, spread shot, triple shot, is any use. It's so, so hard to even hit anything with that. 
Let's see here. The super shots, do they even have a higher range? Yeah, it seems like the arrow is dropping before it even reaches the dragon. The wyvern. Gosh darn it. Oh. Oh, I was out of stamina. Yep, okay, well, that is that. It doesn't work. At least not like this. Let's move on. Let's also re equip my sword. Don't forget that. Again. Or, well, re equip and also two hand. Was there any. Oh, there were lizards, right? Is there anything. any reason to drop down here? No. Yeah, there are these lizards. Roly polies. Yep. There's one right there. Guess I could. Oh, well. Try luring it like this. If my freaking fireball didn't. I'm out of stuff. Awesome. Okay. There's another one up there. When will they actually aggro? Oh, now, apparently. Hello. Go on, the mech lizard. Oh, wow. Okay. Don't get careless with these guys. They are only slightly upgraded. Titanite lizards, but but they are dangerous nonetheless. They are perfectly oh wow yeah the the wyvern is way farther away than I actually thought. Hmm. But I can actually take a shot from here. So um you know just to sate my curiosity, I don't really expect it to do much for me. Okay if. Wow, please, messages. Let me two-hand my weapon. I should be able to hit it from here anyway. Oh! And even deal damage. Although, there's no telling how much or how little. Can I kill it from here? That would be ridiculous. I mean, obviously... Without a health bar, it could be dealing like one damage per arrow. Although I'm hitting it, <laughs> yeah, you can actually see the arrows sticking out of its forehead. If I could inch forward just a tiny little bit more, I might increase my damage, the damage that I deal, assuming that I do deal damage dramatically does not seem interested in coming down here at all, in fact. That seems like the ultimate cheese. Although at this, at this rate I'm probably going to run out of arrows. Oh, thanks for writing my message, I suppose. Also, I don't know why I wasn't doing it before, but I can totally keep my, keep my bow equipped. Come on, I was... I did mean to roll. Just like you, my friend. Oh, nice. Oh, not so nice. Please. <sighs> I guess I deserve that. We're trying to be cheesy. Paid the price in whatever Titanite he dropped. Probably a scale, knowing my luck, but you know. 
Such... Such is uh, fate. And all that. Ah, oh, wait. Why am... Why wasn't I hitting there? One. Two. Three. Four. I'm assuming that uh, hitting the head is preferable to hitting anything else. Didn't really have a good chance to to shoot at the head of that uh, wyvern in on that uh, not not on that settlement um, high wall of Lothric. But I did notice uh, drastically varying amounts of damage depending on what part of the body I actually hit. I can only assume that hitting the head is doing uh, the doing the most amount I can do from here. It also being the closest to me, apart from the from its hands, I suppose. The tip of its wing there, or not the tip, you know, the the joint, second joint of the wing. It is really his hand, I suppose, or its equivalent. I'm probably dealing close to no damage at all. Um, but that will not stop me from actually shooting all my arrows into it. I guess I could also use my Dragon Slayer, like my great arrows. Eh, let's use fire, because I have them. No, that's why we can actually see where we hit the very tip of its of its face, right in the eye. Well, maybe not. Okay, uh, next moonlight arrows, I suppose. Magic damage. Okay. Here's hoping that it doesn't start regenerating at some point. Oh, oh. Wait, what's so special about these again? Um, fly as straight as their master. Hmm. Maybe they actually do fly straighter than others. Okay, these are just 90 lightning and 90 physical damage. Well, let's try and use poison, I suppose. Maybe I can actually get him poisoned with 18 poison arrows. The other option, of course, or the other possibility is that I'm completely wasting a ton of kind of valuable ammunition here without achieving anything at all. Also I realize that this is probably extremely boring to watch but you can always uh, fast forward or oh, fast forward or you know um, skip ahead that's a word. Alright Normal arrows. Oh! Oh! That dealt damage. <laughs> will this hit me? It will not. Wow, so I was not even dealing damage before. Good to know! Good to freaking know. Why make it appear like I was?
47 damage is also very, very, very minuscule amount of damage. I wonder if that's caused by me being too far away. Mostly, oh no, that might hit. Uh, might not hit. My bad. Okay. It's actually very lucky. Also, I'm still amazed that he's not actually hitting me with his fire. Oh, also, I thought there were more than two of these lizards, but I guess not. Okay. Let's not waste any of these arrows. 71 damage. That's better. It's not great, but better. Still, no damage. Jeez, I'm playing with fire here. Ha <laughs> ha, literally. My biggest fear, obviously, being that he will eventually come down here. Okay. This is going nowhere, though. That deals less damage. What the heck? Aren't these supposed to be the be all and all be all dragon slaying weapon? Like anything lightning? This is kind of disappointing. Okay, and now I did it. <laughs> I did it. Awesome. I went too far. Hey, Wyvern, where are you going? Oh, is he retreating? Oh, he's up there. Hello. How nice of you. Ah, god damn it. Why can't I aim higher? Well, I guess I will able to hit his knee for 31 damage. It's like nothing. Okay, where is he? He's back up there. Is he flying from tower to tower now? Okay. Doesn't even care. Like, at all. Okay. I guess <laughs> let's use the last of my arrows, because I have literally used everything else by now. Might as well do that. Wow, that's a lot of damage. Holy crap. I mean, won't be nearly enough to actually achieve anything significant here. But... Oh, am I also inching backwards, <laughs> ever so slightly, from the knockback, from the recoil? Yeah. If I do ever end up fighting this thing in melee, which I will have to if I do want to fight it at all at this point, um, I'm completely out of... Uh, no, wait, that's not what I... Meant to say it all, um, I will have to basically deal 95% of the damage normally anyway. Safe zone, yeah, well, he's not currently creating any unsafe zones to begin with. Though, nope, nope, totally is, totally is. Oh, that was not a safe zone. Maybe I wasn't far enough in. Um, I'd really prefer him to be on that tower at this point. Maybe I'll just... I should probably just make a run for it. Try left. Yeah, well, wow. it's actually a lot better than I expected. It's literally right above me. 
try locking on and then time for range bet. <gasps> is that does that work? Oh, I can't lock him lock onto him from there. Oh god, I totally can. I totally totally can. Yep. Oh, this is the cheese. Too bad I probably don't have enough resources to kill him from here. Oh man, had I known that. <laughs> I feel so dumb now. Wait. Wait, what? What am I hitting? Why isn't that working anymore? Oh, hello! I didn't even see you there. Where's the dragon fire gonna land? Guess I'll wait for him to do that and do a plunging attack. Oh, that didn't even hit. Like, at all. <laughs> shit. Well, shit. Okay, let's try that again. I guess locking on helps with actually hitting. Even for punching attacks, interestingly enough. Oh, fire! Hitting me f through the freaking wall. Okay, this time I hit correctly. The intended way. Ah, uh, seven Estes. Yeah, I should heal up anyway, though. Oh! <laughs> I should have waited for a freaking fire, although I do seem to be safe here. Which is actually kind of surprising. Not very hard to reach this... this place here at all. Okay, seriously, though, why... Wasn't I able to... Oh, now I'm throwing upward. Again? Well, I was for a while. Maybe... Hmm. I seem to be only able to get the lock on from here. But then all of a sudden my character decides not to throw upward anymore. I do have 29 Kukris, but if I waste half of them trying to throw them against a wall... Wow, 180 damage? It's actually pretty, pretty huge. But still, it's not going to be enough, So I shouldn't be wasting them in the first place. Okay, what's he doing now? Did he, did he fly away? I think he did. Hmm. Well, I really hope he's going to return. And if he does, I will return with more arrows. That's for sure. Ambush uh, required ahead. And a nimble one. Wait. Is that a thing? Oh, hello. Great, and I'm completely out of stuff at this point. Nimble one, you say. I don't see a nimble one. But then, oh, maybe that's the nimble one. Holy crap, is that the Swordmaster 2.0? Well, it's not the Swordmaster. Okay. <laughs> that was kind of lucky. Ricard's rapier. So was that Ricard? Or is it just someone using Ricard's rapier? Also, let's not stand where that dude can... Oh. Oh, I get it. I'm dumb, by the way. I finally got it. That guy is actually ringing the bell. Also, I don't know if whoever he summoned is coming for me. It doesn't seem like it. So there totally is a way to stop these uh, summons from happen, uh, from happen, from happening. Ricard's rapier, a strikingly decorative rap rapier, rapier or rapier, of an undead prince spoken of in ancient stories. Although many of the tales surrounding the prince are questionable, this trusting weapon, 
this trusting, thrusting weapon, suggests that the stories of his graceful technique were in fact true. Skill records lunge and press. Assume a quick stance, lunge forward, and execute a stunning chain attack. Sustain offensive with strong attack. So he was trying to do that. Fortunately, he didn't quite. He wasn't quite able to pull through with it. Seriously, though, who is the nimble one? I was told to be aware of. Uh, because normally, when I hear nimble one, I think of ah, god damn it. I think of. Titanite lizards! Holy shit, okay. What the heck? What the heck? You. You guy. That was not cool. Uh, it got me totally stuck in that corner by, the, by that uh, statue and I was completely unable to move. That sucks. I'm not even too worried about the souls. Okay. Um. Come on. Just. Wow. Yeah, I totally didn't even notice the bell they they are holding. Also, what do my arrows say? Um. Wait. I don't have any arrows. Well, shit. Should probably go ahead and refill those. Also, did he not summon anybody this time around? Because I don't think the summon disappears as the summoner dies. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Okay. Oh, there you are. Okay. Keep saying okay, apparently. Ah. God damn it. Grey Rat. Please. Grey Rat? Nope. No rat. So I will only be able to purchase low quality arrows here. Well, hmm. I mean, or very high quality, in fact. Wait. Wooden are 30 damage, feathered are 40. What are the standard arrows then? Are they in between? 35? Hmm, I can't purchase these, however, they are extremely, extremely expensive. Dark arrows now, if, I, if only I knew if uh, how much damage they deal to the dragon. I want to buy like 99 of feather arrows, I suppose. And then maybe a couple Ashen of dark arrows just to try. To try them out. Alright, uh, what I need to do in order to be able to purchase those is pop some souls. 8k? That's actually, actually not bad. That's definitely enough for all the feathered arrows. Well, it's Pop one of these. 5k, that's probably overkill, but you know. Oops. Purchase. Purchase. Like, um, let's see here. 99 of these. And. 28 of these. That's not, not great, one. but it's okay. For experimentation's sake. Ah, okay. He also equipped them for me. How oh, nice. Uh, you know what I should also do is since apparently I've started using it quite a bit now what? and I have all well <laughs> no souls though derp yeah yeah insufficient souls let, me, let me leave this freaking menu holy crap okay how much is this 2000 that should actually be plenty what? well maybe not plenty but enough for now anyway okay bows right Yeah, hmm. 
I guess the scaling is better on this one. So... It'll probably become better in the long run. It's gonna be 119. This is gonna be... Almost as much. Yeah, screw it. I'm just, just gonna... Upgrade Ferris's bow. Because why not? I also don't have Project nearly idea. enough... Uh, nearly, nearly near as much. <laughs> what? Nowhere near as much souls. No, that's that's not even. It's not even the correct correct sentence. Uh, holy crap! What, what was I trying to say? I said I had plenty souls, but I don't. That's the gist of it. Okay, this should be plenty. Now. Did what? Hopefully, maybe. Um, wrong category again. Okay. Yeah, let's get it to plus six, I suppose. Uh, ah, plus seven, why not? You know, why the heck not? Not, Pretty I'm not willing careful. to uh, I don't use any more. It is good, what? Okay, so you can't reinforce Pretty the range of sketch. I didn't think you could, but I wanted to check real quick. So, um, yeah, I'm not willing to spend any more chunks on upgrading the bow right now, since they're still in somewhat limited supply. I mean, I guess I could go ahead and farm those rock lizards, but um, their drops are kind of unreliable, and since they do seem to drop all kinds of different titanite that I'm not necessarily looking for... Oh, wait! He summoned the dude up here, and I was actually able to pull off the backstab. That is totally unexpected. Oh, come on, please. Nope. Not today. Not today, sir. Huh. Well, you never cease learning, I suppose. Alright. Did he manage to summon another one? Yep, totally did. That guy did not respawn. Okay. So that's what must have happened last time. But the knight was up here and I wasn't just just wasn't looking in the right place. Eh. It's gonna be annoying though. Okay. Oh! Well. Got hit. Twice. Oh wow, was out of stamina actually. Good. Good, good. Alright. Well, the mystery of the infinite summons is now... <laughs> is now... has now been solved, at the very least. That's something. Okay, are you gonna try and bite me? Yes, you are. Ah, oh, really? Okay. Large Titanite, sure. Take it. Ah, oh, really? That must have been so close. So close. Wow, okay. That was also pretty close, but in my favor. Eh, I guess I'll lure these guys out one at a time. Aw, oh, really? Should have been a hit. Wait. What did I hear? I thought I heard something like some enemy drop or something behind me. Maybe I'm just turning paranoid here. Crap. All those noises. All them noises. Okay, where was his little friend? Who decided to join in? Oh, oh, wait. Yeah, must have been this one. Completely forgot about that one. Okay, big guy. You're gonna be problematic. Yep, especially if I watch my role like that. Like, completely. 
Oh wow, what? Okay, that hurt. Uh, that hits behind him much farther than I expected, than I ever expected. <sighs> I'm using all my freaking Estes here as well. I hate it. I hate it when I do that. Oh, okay. Was not done swinging. It was now. Kind of. Okay. Screw you, buddy. You are a constant nuisance. Large Titanite. Awesome. Ample recompensation for all the trouble. Not. Okay. Um. Oh, right. Got rid of my normal throwing knives. You, why don't you breathe fire? Or not. Just try to gently bump me. Come on. And let's n not knock him off the cliff this time around. Well, almost knocked him off anyway. It's heal to four. Okay, Wyvern is back. I guess I want to hide in... Oh, hello. Hello. This is not what I wanted at all. <laughs> Why don't you fly up here? Well, this is bad. This is not what I wanted to happen at all. Holy crap. And now? Yeah, now he's just gone. Oh fuck. Unless there's a way to lure him back to landing up there. Well, I'm. I might do that off camera anyway because it's probably going to be annoying and nothing else. Also, there is four of these guys now. Where did they come from? Should I even bother with them? Come on, please. Target. Okay. You chill the heck down. Um, why didn't I attack? Wow. Okay, let's not get stuck here. Okay, let's also lose the freaking lock on. This is horrible! What is happening? These guys. These are these guys are happening. Nope! 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 Ah Jesus! Nope, nope! Freaking lock on. Okay. 
Okay. Ugh. This sucks. This sucks so bad. I do want to kill them too, but, you know, since the dragon is gone anyway, I'm... see no reason why I shouldn't use my bow, actually. Would be silly. A silly thing not to do. Oh, they can actually come up here without a problem. Can they? So they take very little damage from ranged weapons. Which is not entirely surprising. But these guys are getting on my nerves. Have been getting on my nerves so much. Ah, oh, come on. Come on. Really. Can I not hit that one? No, I can. Of course, none of them dropped anything at all. Or did they? No, they did. Okay, never mind. Twinkling and Titanite scale. Wow, okay. I guess it was kind of worth it, but only kind of. That was some horrible, horrible play on my part. Also, I'm probably going to fall down here and squander everything forever. That's nice as well. Is there anything in here? No, there wasn't. Okay. Let's shoot that guy in the face. Oh, nice. He's actually super, super easy. Super fragile. And it should also mean that... Nope. Nobody's getting summoned here. That was just a big bell. Or a big bell. Right. That's where the other... Wait. Or is it? Isn't that where... Uh, the chest was? Am I just not seeing it from here? Is it maybe not loaded? It must be the... The same place. Can't see where else it would be. Okay, so you... Can totally walk up here. This is gonna be a way back to somewhere I've been before. Almost feels like it. That would be somewhat of a waste though. Oh, wait. Nope, nope. Never been there. This is right by the giant bell. To travel the path of the dragon, do not ring the great bell. Okay. Do I want to travel the path of the dragon? What's that? What does that even mean? Is that the path of the dragon, literally, or is that a, some kind of philosophical concept? Can't take it. Nothing will remain once the bell has tolled. Nothing will remain. That sounds pretty drastic. I would like some kind of shortcut. I mean, obviously that. Uh, the way that I took here took me so much. Oh, well, never mind. Bonfire will do just fine. Um, took me way longer than it should have been or needed to. Just by virtue of me, you know, messing up, <laughs> screwing around with those uh, little lizards way more than I should have, and trying to cheese wyverns. This whole place looks strangely tame. I mean, there are a couple more of these guys. Granted. They're kind of nasty for normal enemies, but... No big deal, really. I'm 
remember. Thanks. So there is definitely a way. Oh, maybe... Hmm. Well, I think that maybe uh, ringing the great bell will open this gate. And once I step in there, um, some kind of boss fight against the, I don't know, the last ancient dragon or something will happen. What, what was that? Oh, just some light. And uh, once, once you've angered him, or once you've defeated them, you will not be able to like join a certain covenant, maybe? The dragon covenant? The path of the dragon? That's a thing in this game? I guess since there are the transformations, it's not uh, completely unreasonable to assume. So ultimately, the um, the choice here would end up being: uh, Do you attack the dragon? Oh, hello! Yep, that's going straight through the wall. Ah, come on! Come on! Now, do you attack the dragon and uh, fight an optional boss, I suppose, or do you... I don't know. Um, ally with them. Twinkling Titanites. Sure. Pointless ahead. Okay. So... No illusory wall, I take it. Didn't think there was one. Hello. Is that Havel? Be wary of Boulder. Havel the Rock. Or are you actually referring to someone tossing boulders? I'm also completely not healed. Could try and backstab, but that probably doesn't work. This time he was prepared <laughs> and didn't and didn't get knocked down. But so long as my charged attacks do stagger him, I'll be fine. That was... that was... bad. Ah, really? Okay, I didn't even get hit. It was just... just the uh, impact that staggered me. Nice! <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Okay, will you drop anything else for me? No. <laughs> well, I have had already killed you as a summon, but... Still, no reward at all is kind of lame. I wonder if he's going to respawn. That is... yeah, that's that place. This wyvern is long dead. Oh. Titanite slab. I was expecting to find another one here, to be honest, but... Just like that? Not as a reward for some epic boss fight. Unless Havel was supposed to be that epic boss fight, but... Uh, I mean... Seems a bit silly. That's just... yeah, that's where the giant bell is. Gotcha. I should also really be stopping this episode, I just noticed. Well... Didn't really achieve all too much here. I feel a bit bad for that, actually. Or bad about that. Large soul of a crestfallen knight. Should be a hefty amount. Yeah, okay, so I'm going to return to the bonfire here, even though I don't really need to. And I'm going to uh, finish exploring this place and possibly ringing the, the great bell? 
I'm, I mean, obviously, something significant is going to happen, but, um, well, since I don't know what not ringing the bell would do for me, I guess I'm just going to try it. I mean, it's my first playthrough, and I'm going to experiment. I've done so in the past. I mean, I haven't killed any NPCs or so, or so, uh, to, to see what they drop. Um, yet, but at some point I might do that as well. Maybe not in this playthrough, though. We'll see. So, possibly, um, great events are going to unfold next time. Uh, we'll see. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed so far. If you did, please hit the like button, comment, and subscribe, and I shall see you real soon. Till then, have a wonderful time, and bye-bye.